Happy Thursday. It's time for some more battles um, with the Sabertooth. What do I call it? Sabertooth Dragon Team? Uh, the team from Cobalt. Yeah, Sabertooth and Dragon. Um, our first battle today. We're going against the Screamtail, Brute Bonnet, Iron Thorns, I believe, Torkoal, Sableye, and Iron Moth. Lots of. Past month, lots of, par lots of Paradox Mons the past. It's early in the morning. Um, so their Torkoal is probably going to be big boost in coming. Uh, so we do have Great Test. We can Earthquake. What if we did like Great Test Dragonite? That could be kind of like a solid duo. Because it can hit uh, the Torkoal, the Iron Moth. A little scary for like going against Brute Bonnet, but then we do have Low Kick on the Dragonite, or we can just opt for like extreme speed. Um, <clears throat> Fluttering is pretty solid. Mm, yeah. This Dragonite is what? Terra Flying, right? Yeah. And then I guess maybe we just try and. Have Sabretooth for, uh, for the, like, I guess maybe Sabretooth, like, Dragonite could have been good, but I think Earthquake from Great Test is good, and since we'll be locked into that, um, having Dragonite, since we are a flying type, is very solid. There's Torkoal Sableye. So, can Extreme Speed the Sableye slot? We also can't low kick it. We could like Terra Flying Terra Blast. I don't think. Yeah, I think Dragonite might be the might be who we want to Terra anyway. We just go for a sweet a swift earthquake. And they kind of just mean locked in a Terra Blast is very solid. Sableye can set up screens. Uh, can also go for the fake out. Oh, so maybe we should have. Yeah, this uh, this would be rough. Cause well, hmm. Okay, there's a Terra. We actually should have like slowed down a bit. I think they're gonna fake out the Great Tusk. Um. Oh. Just quashing us. We should have probably doubled into Torkoal that turn. Because, yeah, this eruption is going to be scary. Oh, we've got. Fuck. <sighs> Great us no! It's okay. Mm. I think we have to go into Fluttermane. They could have Iron Thorns come in. We'll get our Protosynthesis boost. They're Slithering, okay. And they do have their Terra on, um... Torkoal. So the wings attack is boosted. So say if we go for a dazzling gleam. Uh, Torkoal. Okay, slithering swap. So that's fine. We're gonna see their last mon. Iron thorns. That's okay. That's uh, booster. I forget Iron Thorns is a future one. Big boost and attack. We'll get this Dazzling Gleam off. Not doing a whole lot, but the Terra Blast. Should hopefully bring Torkoal to the red. Oh, just ever so slightly. <clears throat> Hits the Heat Wave on both. Yeah, 
Dragonite, you put in, you put in work. Maybe if we would have Moonblasted the Torkoal. Um. Okay, let's see here. That attack got boosted. Um. We should be the fastest thing out here. They can't tear. I think. I still think. I. We. I think we might be okay. Maybe they were thinking we were gonna sucker punch that. We got a dazzling gleam off, and then a low kick. We we know Fluttermane and Saber two speed tie. Um, Fritz big boost in. Okay, and then Slytherin comes in. We played definitely very sloppy, but uh, I didn't realize Slytherin stands like that. At least they didn't get an, a, a speed boost here. I didn't mean to click that. We just go into the Shadow Ball. Mm. I think we just go for the Sucker Punch. Faster? The heck does first impression do? Does that just is that is that a priority move? Torkoal's gone. There has a priority of plus two. Okay. Um bug move. It always fails if after the first user is out. Let's do this dust and gleam off, and then we'll be able to get the sucker punch. Sucker punch will be able to go. Oh, I thought we kind of kind of messed up there um I mean the same light went for quash instead of fake out but um we could have done damage on the torkoal we would have had great test because great test would have definitely helped out uh, in the end game but we're still able to you know clean it up but that we made master ball let's go okay for a second I was like damn now that we made master ball are we just gonna be hitting a bunch of um Justin Tang's teams. Uh, well, the Dragon Bolt team. But, this one. Fluttermane, Fish, Amoongus, Gyarados. Stone and Dragonite. Hmm. I mean, Fluttermane and Fish is definitely a scary lead for sure. Um... Are they faster? Fish lower special attack, right? No, fish lower special defense. So if we do that, they can't fake us out. Great Tusk isn't like the greatest thing. Flutter mains okay. And then do we go Dragonite? I want to tear a Dragonite. Uh, because Loki can help out with stone. Great Tusk is kind of like, eh, because of the Gyarados. Can't hit it. Uh, the Dragonite. Can't really hit it. Just with the mean flying types. I think it's it. Fluttermane, Fish. Not me freaking what else. Stone. Amoongus. Yeah. Dragonite. Dragonite's a lot better. For sure. Um, I think Lilligan should be faster, so we should be able to, like, Get an attack off with Torkoal. They're Stone and Gyarados, so they're a little scared of the Fluttermane fish. Lead. Hmm. Leave the sun up. Would you just want to, like, Leaf Storm? We can sleep out of the Gyarados. I mean, both of these things threaten Torkoal. Let's 
Say we leave storm that and we go for a protect. That's okay. Here's hoping Garrett doesn't for like a waterfall on Torkoal. Oh, you're just gonna taunt us. Okay. Damn, we should, uh, kind of wish you got that sleep powder off. Uh, anyway, mm, do we swap out Torkoal here? Stone just protected, so we can attack that. Um... Should we go into Dragonite? Mm, I don't know. I don't think we play turn one out. So well, we'll get the sleeve storm off. Um, bring stone down to sash. That's okay. Stone with the rock slide and Gyarados with the waterfall. Nice. Okay. Um. I mean, stone could protect. I really don't want to terra flying just yet. Um, we're gonna just go for the extreme suit on Gyarados. Um, I'm thinking Stone might protect here, just because Dragonite does have extreme speed. Hmm, Stone does not. Okay. Damn. And Gyarados goes for Thunder Wave. Okay. It's not the worst thing. Um... Now it just depends on if Torkoal can hit, uh... Yeah, Terra Steel is not... I'm kind of feeling like, what if we just, what if we just do that? Uh, I don't think there's a reason to- they probably have Fluttermane Fish in the back, so I don't- Guess we- mm, I don't know, it's iffy. Maybe we should've waited, uh, Terra Fluttermane, but then their fish just goes for fire moves, and I don't think we can do damage on it just yet. Oh. <laughs> well, this Gyarados stone is going to, uh, absolutely fuck us, because Torko's gonna go down this turn. Um, it doesn't matter the wide guard because. Oh, Torkoal's actually living. Okay. Hmm. The thing is, do we think they taunt? What if we just sleep out of the Gyarados? R.I.P. R.I.P. Mm. Okay. Just the Thunder Wave. So you've seen Thunder Wave Waterfall. Sun's gone. Uh, Stone could go for wide guard, so we kind of have to lock into. I think we just lock into Moon Blast here. Put Stone to sleep, maybe. Mm hmm. Yeah. 
Let's go for this Moonblast. Knocks out the Gyarados. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can do this with Fluttermane. If we can kind of let Stone be over here on the side. Yeah, we hit that. Um, Fluttermane can, like, solo this Mon. Stone they are, because of that, they are getting, like, the Power Spot boost. Um, unfortunately. Yeah, because, like, a Terra Steel here would have been great. Booster, special attack, okay. We could double into that. There's their Terra. Ah, <sighs> I mean, uh, Terra Steel most likely. Oh, Terra Fairy, so just big boost and Dazzling Gleam. Lilligant might go down this turn. We're going first. <sighs> well, you want to know what? It's not like the absolute worst. Stone's asleep. Yeah, Stone being faster than the Lily again. You know, we at least got two knockouts. Not bad. Um. We can get three if we knock out stone, we'll see. If fish is the last one, then, uh... GG, we definitely didn't play the Torkoal. I don't know. Oh, it's Dragonite. Uh, uh, Dragonite's got extreme speed, so it's a big boost in. Uh, stone was gonna go for Protect? I'm not too sure what I was gonna go for. I know with the extreme speed. Really getting you tried. We could have knocked out stone. Um, yeah, not bringing fish. Not bringing fish. Um, I didn't think that. I thought I thought they would bring fish. But anyway, yeah, we didn't. We didn't play that too well. We did get some knockouts. Um, we could have probably. If we didn't Terra Torkoal there, it would have probably been, like, better to just Terra, um, Fluttermane. Like, that's what we should have done, and maybe, maybe, maybe we could have done better. But, you know, uh, it's still a good battle, it's still a good battle. We, we learned, we learned. Alright, ooh. Amoongus, Fluttermane, Palathin, Dragonite, Buckethead, and Arcanine. Hmm. Torkoal again doesn't look good here. What if we went? Um, they can intimidate us. Hmm. Maybe I like these two. I think I like the top four, but I want to make sure this is the order we want to bring them in. Do we want Sabretooth and Dragon at the lead? An, Arcan an Arcanine lead kinda... Kinda does suck. Um... Yeah, I think Arcanine's gonna be... The toughest thing. Maybe if we have, like, Sword Saber... You know, maybe we go these two and have these two in the back. That might, I think that might be, that might be what we want to do. Um, and as for like our Terra option, mm, if we see a Moongus, like, might be a little bit of a pain. Um, so we always have like the Terra flying, that we can go with the Dragonite. If we want to lock into Terra flying. Um, okay. And yeah, we get a special attack of everything. I think it's Tinglu probably. Probably does spread damage. Probably Terra. Either they stay like that, they take Dazzling Gleam damage. 
Mm. We just try and lock into Rock Slide. I'm gonna still probably Rage Powder. I still think we'll just try and go for the Headlong Rush. Um, but I'm figuring Buckethead. I think the most common Terra type is Poison. Um, but like, yeah, there's the Poison. Um, I'm gonna say the Terra types sit very well in the bucket head. Oh, they don't Rage Powder. Okay. So what's the Moongus gonna do? Just go for a Spore? We get this Dazzling Gleam off? Fuck. <laughs> this shit's so bulky. And the Moongus Spores. Damn. Hmm. Okay, what do we want to do here? If we go into Dragonite... Great Test has to take its turn to sleep. Amoongus could protect, but like... We do have to get rid of it. I, I do think we lock into Terra Blasting that. Uh. I think we'll swap in Saber too. We have to remember Great Toss hasn't taken its turn to sleep. I think we should have gone Dragonite, um, uh, Dragonite Great Tusk. That's... That's the lead we should have gone for. Again, learning. Moves to the Protect, okay, that's... Fine. This one just- is it just going for an Earthquake? Pretty sure. Okay. So they can stop being Tantrum this turn. We're gonna do that. And we're gonna go for the Ice Cold Crash. It's only 90% accurate, but... If... Amoongus Rage Powders, it's gonna take the Ice Cold Crash. First, and then it'll get the Terra Blast. Um, okay, no Rage Powder. Nice, Buckethead's gone. So our opponents use their Terra, we've used our Terra, we get this big Terra Blast off. Should get the knockout with like, defenses lowered. Yeah, okay. And then we see what we have here. We still have our Sash intact. Um, Great Tuss in the back still hasn't taken any turns to sleep. It's a little unfortunate, but uh, we'll see how this duo, this duo does. If we want to stay locked into Terror Blast, there's Flutter Main. Yeah, Terror Blast is still solid for that. And then Arcanine. With the Intimidates on both of these. Which kinda sucks. Kinda sucks. But, if we can knock out the Flutter main, I think Flutter main protects this turn. It might, right? We can haze away the Intimidate. We can haze away the Intimidate. And Flutter main protects, like, Mm, we still have our multi-scale up on, yeah, multi-scale, up on Dragonite. So we should be fine this turn, and if we can get rid of Fluttermane, uh, great test in the back, even though he's sleeping, should be okay. Um, okay, they get the Dazzling Gleam off. It doesn't even bring us to Sash. We get the Haze. 
which is great. And we get this Terra Blast off. Arcanine knocks out Sabretooth. No, it doesn't knock out Sabretooth. Okay. So we're, we're locked into that, but... <clears throat> I don't know, Fluttermane... I just assume Fluttermane protects, but we still have to go for the Sucker Punch just in case. Um, Dragonite is faster than the Arcanine, so we can get a Terra Blast off. And I don't think Arcanine can knock out both of these Mons. So they would be opting to go for... Uh... Yeah, Fluttermane with the Protect. I don't know about this. Oh, we just knock out the Arcanine. Let's go. Okay. Um, thing is, though. Great Toast still has to take a turn to sleep. Dragonite's super low. I honestly think a Moom... I mean, I think a Dazzling Gleam just... wrecks us. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, we tried, but yeah, great test taking that turn of sleep. R.I.P. <laughs> it was a crit on the Dragonite. It was a double crit. We tried. Um, we definitely... We, we didn't need a double into... Maybe we, maybe we would have swapped out Saber into Great Tusk. Yeah, that's probably what we could have done. We would have swapped out Grape, but now we know. I gotta, I gotta write that down because we gotta figure out if I knew Terra Blast was gonna knock out the Arcanine, then we could have swapped out. So it's something that we would just in like game two. Um, that in that point, like we would have been safe to like swap out Great Test just to have Saber Tooth uh, at the end game for a Sucker Punch for that knockout. Uh, oof, for the time. We'll be testing a different team next week. I'm not too sure which Rune Mon. Honestly, maybe Buckethead. Um, I'm, I'm a little scared to test out the fish, but those are our battles for today. See y'all next time with some more battles.